Hello, in this video, I just wanted to basically show you how to get reliefs showing up in the relief clip art library. So on the Carveco Facebook group, Robert Newman has been kind enough to create some reliefs and I wanted to show you how to get those into the relief clip art library. Now you could just select these and drag them into the software, but it would be really cool if they were already in the library so you could just grab them from out of there. I'll show you how to do it. It's pretty easy to do. First of all, you can see that I've got these six reliefs that he's created. If you want to see these just in the folder, rather than have them listed like this, if you go to, if you right click, select view, and then use either extra large icons or large icons, it will actually give you a, a, a pretty basic preview of them. Okay? So you get some sort of idea what they are, and then you can just drag them into the software. But what I want to do is put these into the Relief Clip Art Library. So let me open up Maker. Okay, so there you can see I've just got a completely blank session. Let's go to New Model. I'm not worried about the sizes or anything for this because I just want to access that library. Select OK and it opens up Carveco Maker. So what I'm going to do is open up the Relief Clip Art Library and you can see that mine has defaulted to the Animals folder. Now this doesn't matter where you are as long as you can see a relief. So what I want you to do is right click on any relief and then select locate file. Okay, so that locates that file and basically it opens up this path that I have here. So you could just browse to this area here. So see users, your name, documents, carve code reliefs. It's a bit long-winded. It's just easier to just literally right-click on a relief and locate it. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to go up a folder. So if you click there, that arrow up, it will go up a folder. Okay, and then you can see all of the folders for the relief clip art library. So any folder that you get here is shown here. Okay, right, so let me minimize Maker for a second and I'm just going to move that and move that. And let me just put those back to being a list. Okay, right, so in this folder here, what I'm going to do is right click anywhere on the blank screen, make sure that you don't create a folder within a folder. I want this to be just in this reliefs folder. I'm going to go to new folder so it shows up down the bottom and I'll just call this Halloween. Okay, and then if I go into that Halloween folder, you can see that it's empty. I'm going to grab those and you can either copy them or move them there, it doesn't really matter. And then I've just copied all these over to there. So then if I open Maker back up again, if I click on this drop down and just scroll through, you can see under H, I haven't got Halloween. That's because it hasn't been sort of marked yet. It doesn't know that it's there and it doesn't know to look for it. So what you need to do is select new. So if you click on that, it will automatically take you to that folder. And you'll see that I've got a Halloween folder in there. So if I click that and then select OK, you can see that I've got all of those Halloween reliefs in there. So what I can do is just grab one of those and drag it in. Okay, and then it saves you having to keep on closing the software. So you can also switch back to something else, let's say fantasy, let's say that I wanted the Pegasus in there. And then 
I can go back to it. It's always going to be there. Now, the first time that you do this, it will show up down the bottom. When you reopen Carveco Maker, it will be in alphabetical order. Okay. And then you can put another one back in there. Okay, so that's how you import reliefs into the relief clip art library. Now, for them to show up as this yellow colour, they need to be newer reliefs. If they are RLF 9 rather than RLF, then what they'll show up like is sort of a, a grayscale colour in there. And also, this won't work with STLs or any 3D files. It's just RLF files, so just relief files. So I hope this helps you out. Cheers. Take care. Goodbye.